everybody. We're back. I'm back. After a very long two and a half weeks. Uh, I've been sick. It's been rough on me. But I'm back. Ready to go. And today we got another build. <clears throat> Excuse me. Being a drag car out of the Cadillac CT5 V Blackwing. So I'm gonna, let's get straight on into it. We're gonna hit the speed trap and then we're gonna do the race. And then we'll get into the build and tune for you guys. Okay, so 200 through the speed trap is pretty good. It's a Okay, so this is how I kind of look at it, is, um, through the speed trap, about 180 to 190 is about average, then, like, 195 to 200 is like slightly above average and then it's like you got the insane cars like the Copo Camaro and the Lamborghini Diablo and the Toyota e 86 that are flying through that speed trap at like 230 from a dig <laughs> and those cars are insane of course we got the anti-lag set up here So we're going to hit up the drag strip and see what our time is looking like on here. What year is this CT5? Is it a 22? Is it 2022? Or? I don't know. I'm not exactly up to date on the Cadillacs, to be honest. Yeah, this is really like a nice car though to look at visually. It's it's really good looking. If only I had ninety thousand dollars to give, <laughs> I would. But anyway, let's get straight on into it. Let's see what we're clocking here. I'm guessing, considering on average cars are about fifteen to sixteen seconds. And this is slightly quicker, I'm going to say around 14-ish. thought I heard my door open, but I guess I'm tripping. Um, 14.2. Wow, that was really close. Yeah, on average, a drag car will be around 15 to 16 seconds. Then you got the slightly above average, it's about 14. Then it's like you get the really fast ones that are like 13, 12. Like, yeah, it's, it's a fairly quick drag car. I, I feel like you could really like tear up an like an open lobby. And yeah, I feel like you definitely tear up an open lobby with one of these. And it's also been a minute since we made a drag car. I just realized that like, we haven't made a drag car in a while. Okay, so we're Any second now. Okay. Honestly, because this is a new car, I kind of want to see what the uh, manufacturer colors are looking like. Oh, wow. So we got this, like, bluish-black kind of color. Got a very, very bright orange. See, I'm rocking with the blue. I like this Cadillac red that they've been putting on their cars lately. It's really nice. Really rocking with this blue, though. I swear, I keep hearing my door open. <clears throat> Alright, um... Onto the build. 
Why is it gray now? What the heck happened? <laughs> Hold on. What happened? Why is it gray? What happened to that really nice navy blue? You guys know I love navy blue. Okay, that time my door actually did open. Um, yeah, what the heck? What the heck, man? Oh, now it's navy blue. That was weird. Okay. It's like a blackish blue. It's like a navy kind of. You can see in the pearl. It's like black with a navy blue pearl. I really like that. Okay, we got... I did do an engine swap because it saved me... A solid, like, I want to say it was a like quarter of a second. But yeah, racing 7.2. It might have been a half a second. I don't know. <clears throat> All wheel drive. Twin Turbski. A couple of spoolie boys on there. The arrow. I mean, like, if you guys really want to, you could. And I'm looking at that. Oh dang, it drops off like 10 miles per hour, never mind. <laughs> I'm leaving the arrow off. Is this, does this help us at all? Does it help me? Not really. I kind of like the little wing. No, it's not even a wing. A little spoiler they got on there. You guys want to put the arrow and go for it. Of course, we got the drag tire compound, 295, 325 stock. Max rear track width, no front track width. I have the stock tire. Uh, wheels on it, but we all know. Oh man, should I put bead locks on it though? Cause I know the bead locks are like some of the lighter wheels in the game. It saves me time. I might do it. Might do it. I'm gonna do it. No, I'm not gonna do it. I really like the stock wheels, to be honest. They're they're not bad looking. I'll go with the wed sports like I normally do. The TC 105 ends. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but my dog is behind me and he wants a treat. But I just gave him one, so he's not getting one. I don't have any treats, man. <laughs> Alright, anyway, 7 speed transmission, race driveline, race diff, the rally springs of course, race front anti-roll bars, race rear anti-roll bars, race weight reduction, no roll cage, cause this car's heavy enough as it is, it's a big old car, well let's see, we got race fuel system, race ignition, race engine block, race flywheel, race intercooler, and we have the race turbo with anti-lag, but you could do no anti-lag if you want, but I like all the pops, so, do we change anything? I think, we, yeah, we changed the wheels, huh? I hate that every time I like I do the tune, like I can change a setting and it's like good, but then it's like I want to see if I can get it faster, and then I change it back to the setting that it was good at because I couldn't get it faster, and then it's not the same number. At one point, I had this at one point like one one three, and I was tripping, like what the heck, but I couldn't get it back there. But anyway, uh, tire pressure fifteen fifteen. Performance, you want the 2.20, then actually all this is stock, the gearing except for final drive. Alignment, you want 0, 0, negative 0 0.0, 0 0.5, 0 0.0, 0 0.0, 0 0 1.0. The anti-roll bars, leave them stock, then the springs, you want 
uh, all the way stiff in the front, all the way soft in the rear. They ride height all the way high in the front, all the way high in the or all the way low in the rear, unless for some okay, we're going all the way up. <coughs> then rebound, you want 20, 20, and then your bump, one and then twenty. Arrow, if you have it, leave it. Actually, if you have it, go all the way to speed. Um braking, got hundred percent, two hundred percent for easier Bernies and then 100 Excel, 0 D cell, 100 Excel, 0 D cell, then 82% towards the rear. And you got freaking crazy Bernie machine that is a really good drag car. I want to do a burnout. I'm fiending for a burnout. <laughs> Alright, let's go do a burnout. I also have not attempted a burnout in this car, but we're gonna find out. I'm spinning. Okay. So this freaking rear brakes are red hot. Look at them, they're bright red. Fine, no burnout. Actually, no, we can't do a burnout. I'm feeling for a burnout. We need to do a burnout. I guess that's kind of a burnout. Alright, I guess not. <laughs> Wait, was I in second gear when I tried to do that? Or I do it over here? faster all wheel drive so that's what I did but I can do donuts and that's how we're ending today's video we're doing donuts Thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one. And that's all for me today.